makes look really soft. You know? Yeah, fantastic win. Um, you know, we, we know it's always difficult to come here and, and, and Bronte Darlings have still got a chance of making the playoffs and weren't, weren't going to make it easy for us. But, you know, the lads are disappointed off of uh, last week's uh, I've pointed out the six wasn't the sort of standard we've been setting uh, and showed a great response. I think that coupled to the, you know, some of the comments that, that I think went out in their press about what they did to us, our place um, earlier in the season that, that, you know, that's, you know, we have a look at the press and the lads get fired up by it and it's, you know, they didn't necessarily do anything to our place. Yeah, they won the game but played 75 minutes with 10 men and put them on the back foot and, you know, for the lads to be sort of questioning that way and, Kind of make out that, that we got you know absolutely panned at our place was I think a, a, for me the wrong thing to say but it's certainly all the um, stimulus that, that those players needed to go out and show what they're all about. But overall the 90 minutes are really solid performance. Yeah, and... I mean you look at it in the, you know in the first half against the wind we've had the better chances. We've, you know we missed one from from five yards. Um, Wes hits the bar. It's an absolute stonewall penalty as far as I'm concerned and most everybody else in the ground and these moments don't happen for us and you know when you come away from home you, you need those situations to happen. You know, fully, you know, I fully agree that you know, Darlington's had two good moments early on in the second half where we started a little bit slow um, but we made, we made a change and Fabio's come on and had a fantastic impact on the game and uh, Lee you know, back on the score sheet is great for us and it's just that you know, again the character of the players um, I think they respond, you know, when they get questioned and they'll dig deep for one another. And, and you know, I've had to today. You know, it's not a great deal in the game, but we've come up with the big moments and thoroughly deserve the win. And as you say, Fabio came on and made a difference, and you were without some, some important players. Yeah, this is it. You know, and a lot of that, you know, if people outside, you know, unless you're like quite fairly closely connected with the club, won't know. But yeah, you know, Glenn's away today. Jordan's Jordan's not fit. Tarek's not fit. Um, yeah, you know, we've still got Jeff out and. It's just because you know I couldn't speak highly enough with the players just to show that response, you know, away from them after a long journey and um, to, to keep going in the way that they did and show that endeavour and, and cling to it like we have. And yeah, it's just you know, credit to all those boys and you know, still plenty to play for, which you know, we will do right to the very end. And just a word about the first goal from, from Lee. It's been a couple of games since he was on the score sheet and he really took his chance well. Yeah, it's written as well, you know, well worked move. I think you know, Fabio's got a Shown that little bit of you know composure at the right time, settled the ball and curled it into the top 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 corner. And it's a it's a fantastic moment for him. And again, you know what a terrific guy is. You, you know, you, you, like like they all do, you put them wherever and ask them to play wherever they will do. Obviously, we shifted him across centrally, and I think that is his, in his ideal position. He is, you know, he is very flexible and will play wherever for you. But I think that, you know he really came alive when we played him a little bit more centrally. Um, and just delighted for him, you know, there's moments where he's a little bit frustrated with himself where uh, he would have expected to score one or two goals in, in recent games and it hasn't quite happened, but like I say, he's a great lad, he keeps going and keeps working hard at his game and just delighted for him and, and, and the group as a whole, but like I say, it's a difficult place to go and, and they still have plenty to play for and just dealing with everything considered, it's, it's a great result for us. Terrific, terrific afternoon for everybody, well done. Thank you.